Closure could be coming for families of those killed in the 1921 Tulsa race massacre. The thought is many people were left buried in unmarked graves with no headstones for loved ones to mourn. Tulsa Mayor Gigi Bynum now opening an investigation to find the truth. There is still this fog of history where uh, we don't know everything that happened. Two Works for You reporter Megan Allison shows us the remaining mystery behind the city's greatest tragedy. If we can identify a place where there are bodies, we have a responsibility to look into that. It's a challenge close to Mayor G.T. Bynum's heart. As a city councilor in 2012, he learned about the possibility of mass graves from the 1921 race riot that some believe took hundreds of lives. Bynum opened an investigation and tells us nothing ever came of it. It is the great tragedy in the history of our city, and it's something that uh, was such a point of shame for our community for so many years that people did not talk about it. There's no marked graves in this section of Oaklawn Cemetery. It's one of the spots the city will look into as they suspect a mass grave site underneath. This is a murder investigation, and whether you were murdered in 2018 or 1921, the city has a compact with you that we will do everything we can to find out what happened to you and, and bring that to justice. My oldest son, he, he tells Rashad me. Woodrow is the grandson of one of the last known survivors from the massacre. Hazel Jones passed away in March, and Woodrow believes his grandmother would see this as a step in the right direction. The first step of true healing with what went on back in 1921. And I, and I feel like those victims, they deserve a proper burial. The city plans to spend the next few months looking at technology to determine if there are unmarked graves, the cause of death, and identify bodies where needed. That's the first step on us coming together as one in Tulsa and, and, and the fact that Tulsa's finally accepting accountability for what, what happened. Bynum's team will also survey New Block Park and Booker T. Washington Cemetery. Reporting in Tulsa, Megan Allison, Two Works For You.